GIA Automotive 2013 Dodge Charger. I'm putting a bumper on this one today. Um, this bumper support here, I just put this on. That snaps on. Um, there's no there's no screws for it. It just it just snaps on there, snaps onto the metal uh, bumper. Supposed to snug it, and I'm gonna put the skid plate on here. Take a notice of this. Made in Taiwan. Um, he bought this broken mesh that goes behind the grill and then the bumper. So when you buy this stuff from Taiwan, you have to line it up exactly each each uh, plastic notch has to go line it up before you press into it and uh, the mesh is the last part that goes on the front goes first through the front of the bumper you see here on the it keeps popping out um, because it's not exact fit so I'm, I'm gonna finesse it make it work put it out in the sun maybe the sun will help it soften up a little bit more but once you put that grill on the front part then you flip it over and you put the mesh on and the notches that the grill has will go through the mesh and lock it down and then these little round circles here that's where you put like a phillips screw like this one here um so then after that you snap it on onto the car So see it sits in place and the screw will hold it down so that'll be the last thing so I just wanted to show you what I had to do um, all this aftermarket stuff see made in Taiwan it'll fit um, you see the difference see this one Chrysler Chrysler logo um, fits better this bumper here made in Taiwan so that's why it's not just gonna snap into place you gotta you gotta manipulate it and squeeze 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 the front bumper move the tabs you see that how I move this and the tabs move with it. So you have to do stuff like that to line it up before you force it on there. All right, 30 years of experience, GIA Automotive. Thank you for watching. Thank you for everybody that has subscribed. We've, we've reached 1,000 subscribers and um, more videos to come. Thank you for watching.